Want to kill the Reaper and also farm for some Umbral scorings? Well, today I'm going to be showing you how to do this very easy and very fast. You're, you're not going to need to engage them. You're just going to be able to outsmart them. So if you like how that sounds, a like is appreciated. Now, let's dive into this video and let me show you what exactly you need. Now, first thing first is you're going to need the following. Either you're going to get the uh, like a crossbow, in this case, the Howard Delva crossbow. This one's very OP and some arrows. But if you don't have this, you could also do it with, um, let's just say if you have a explosion grenade, like in this case, it's a regular grenade, maybe a grenade that shoots fire or even something that shoots like poison. Now, that you have those two different type of items completed. Another thing that you could also input is the following, which is going to be this um, pendant. Now this pendant allows you to hit the opponent or meaning like anyone that you're going to hit for um, a lot more than what actually you will be doing damage of. So that is a good tip if you didn't know that. So what we're gonna do is we're going to go into the Ambler, Ambler world. As we are in the Ambler world, we're going to wait for the Reaper to make his appearance. Once he makes his appearance, we're going to wait over here to this location because as you guys know, the closer you are to the Vestige, the, he's not going to show up. So we're going to need to make sure that you're watching also the eye on the right section. So before it turns red, actually, as it turns red and the Reaper, the red Reaper, it's here by this edge. You're going to run all the way to the elevator right here, to this elevator. You're going to go downstairs. And now this is where the second phase is. Also, as so we are dropping down, make sure you get your ammunitions and you're definitely are going to need those red stones because once the red Reaper comes in, you're not going to be able to heal yourself and that is going to be the only way you're going to be able to do that. So as you are going come in here, uh, make sure you take off, you take care of any of those snipers that are shooting at you. Because if you don't take them out, then they're going to come and mess with you while you're trying to do your run. So as you take out the snipers, you are going to come to this corner that is located in this section. So you see this cross over here, you're going to walk towards it and then you're going to station yourself right here in this location road reaper is not going to be able to get you so what he's going to do he's going to come right in front of you and he might get really close to you but he's not actually going to do any damage to you because he can touch you as long as you are here and then from here if you have your crossbow or if you have anything else that you can throw at him and kill him that would be the easiest and fastest way now sometimes he does get glitched downstairs on the bottom so to get him out of there or if he's glitched somewhere to get him out just come back to the edge and then go back to where the cross is and come back to the same location where you were stationed so from here, you're going to be killing him. And that is going to be the easiest way to be able to kill the Reaper itself, the Red Reaper, of course. And then it's going to be also a good way if you want to farm the Umbro scoring. So I hope this video was very informative to you. If it does, a like is appreciated. Also, consider subscribing to the channel because we'll be bringing to you guys even more videos about Lords of the Fallen.